Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Letitia if you are new here. So I haven't really had a chance to sit down and talk to you guys since my last um, body positivity video. So today I wanted to actually talk about some things such as cellulite, stretch marks, dimples and varicose veins. I can't even explain to you how self-conscious I used to be about my legs because they have varicose veins on there, they have um, cellulite, there's dimples partially on my ass, I have stretch marks on the sides of my love handles, like people say to me, oh you don't have this and you don't have that, uh, I do, I have all of this good stuff. <laughs> so from about 12 years old, I have had varicose veins, I just remember hating how my legs look, especially when I went to school and I would see all the the other girls that were wearing these cute little skirts and they had just these flawless legs and I was like why do I have to be the one burdened with these ugly veins and then the cellulite came and I was like well this is just shit I've got the worst legs in the world well that's what I thought like I I hated my legs like I hated them and I remember this one time I went to Thailand and this is when I was so insecure and I hated how my body looked, hated how my legs looked. I remember we were walking along one of the strips in Koh Samui and there was this lady that was wearing these short shorts and she had cellulite all on her legs and I remember judging her. And I know that sounds really bad but I did. I looked at her and I was like, ugh. How can you walk around with short shorts and have your legs showing all the cellulite and all the dimples? And as I've gotten older and as I've learned to love who I am, I look back at that mindset and I realize that that was my own insecurity that I was putting onto a person that definitely wasn't insecure about themselves. I think this could be an issue as to why people attack other people and put other people down because they have their own insecurities themselves and they put their insecurities onto you. And I've experienced it firsthand. I used to think like that until I learned to accept and love myself. And I want you to guys to accept and love yourselves and just know that having varicose veins and cellulite and dimples and stretch marks doesn't define you as a person. Unfortunately, not everyone's skin is flawless and I've got lumps, I've got bumps, I've got varicose veins. It took me a while to learn to love who I am, but at the end of the day, I'm not going to let these things dictate my happiness and what I want to do with my life because I know in the past it used to stop me from doing things like stop me from going out, stop me from dressing up, stop from doing certain activities because I was so insecure about how my body looked and what people thought about me. And I think the moment that you let go of what people think about you and you learn to love who you are, these things are so irrelevant. They're so minuscule. Like there's so many other things that you could be spending your energy and your time on than worrying about some lumps or some stretch marks. I just want to see more and more women learning to love who they are and accepting who they are because it's so beautiful to see. It's so empowering and I just, I, I hope that this message gets across to you. If you think that there's someone that needs to see this video, then make sure you share it with them because I think it's important to get this message across, particularly for younger women that are growing up in this world that is so stylized to perfection. <laughs> Which is just not reality. It isn't. It's not reality and it's so easy to compare yourself to other people. Just know that you are good enough, you are worthy and don't let these little things hold you back from the things that you want to do in your life. I hope you've taken something positive away from this video today. Um, I know a lot of people might not be able to relate or you know some people might like to leave their wonderful opinions in the comment box but at the end of the day I'm trying to send a positive message to people about loving and accepting who they are and not comparing themselves to someone else because they look or live or are a certain way. So if you're interested in seeing more videos like this, please let me know in the comment box below and I will love to have these discussions with you guys and hopefully I will see you in my next video. Thank you so much for tuning in and watching today.